Promotion Aptitude Test Questions and Answers that are likely to come Part 2. 101. The practice of delegating power throughout an education system is known as Delegation, Decentralization. 102. Which new act regulates education regulatory bodies? Answer Act 2020, Act 1023. 103. The Education Regulatory Bodies Act 2020 was passed in the year. Answer, August 21, 2020. 104. Which Education Act was passed to establish Ghana Tertiary Education Commission for Technical and Vocational Education and Training, NTC, NASLA, and NACCA? Answer, Act 2020, Act 1023. 105. Which body may acquire and hold property, dispose property, and enter into contract or any other related transaction? NTC, NASLA, Ghana Tertiary Education, GS, Answer Ghana Tertiary Education Commission, GTC. 106. Ghana Tertiary Education Commission is governed by which act in acquiring state land? Answer Act 1962, Act 125. 107. How many committee form the governing body of the Ghana Tertiary Education Commission, GTC? Answer 9. 108, Vision 2020 has its that. Answer by the year 2020 all children of school going age must be in school. 109, the arms of the government are the executives, legislature and. Answer. Judiciary. 110, the mandate of the Ministry of Education is. Answer to formulate national education policies and programs for all levels of education in the country. 111. An educational reform in 2007 extended the normal duration of senior high education by one year, creating a four-year phase. This reform was reversed by new government in. Answer 2009. 112. All the day-to-day -day financial transaction of a school are enter in the. Answer. Petty Cash Book. 113. Focus learning environment and learning environment are two, two, principles of leadership for learning. Answer. Focus learning and learning environment. 114. Gallup is an acronym for. Answer. Ghana Accountability for Learning Outcomes Project. 115. The Vice President Dr. Mahamudu Bawumia on December 14, 2021 launched the. Answer. Ghana TV service to bring together all the 187 TVT institutions spread across 19 ministries under one umbrella to help revamp and mainstream technical and vocational education and training in the country. 116. The reappointment of a teacher who was interdicted a result of a disciplinary investigation, but cleared of all charges is referred to as. Answer. Reinstatement. 117. How many TV, technical vocational education and training, institutions are spread across 19 ministries under one umbrella to help revamp and mainstream technical and vocational education and training in the country? Answer. 187, 187. 118. How many agencies currently work under the auspices of the Ministry of Education? Answer 19. 119, the following are the directorates with Ministry of Education except Internal Audit, Planning, Budgeting, Monitoring and Evaluation, Procurement, Public Relations. Answer Public Relations. 120. The National Teachings Council is established by Answer. Education Regulators Body Act 2020, Act 1023. 121. That the agency of the Ministry of Education responsible for the implementation of approved pre tertiary educational policies and programs is. Answer. Ghana Education Service. 122. The private schools unit at Ministry of Education was established in. Answer. 1974, 124.
Which of the following is Municipal Education Oversight Committee, MOC, responsible for? Basic schools, secondary schools, technical schools, all of the above, answer. Basic schools. 125. Which of the following organization evaluates, monitors and coordinates the implementation of sector policies and strategies of the state and non-state actors in education? Ghana Education Service, GES, Ghana Tertiary Education, GTE, Ministry of Education, Parliament of Ghana. Answer. Ministry of Education. Mo. 126. The teacher licensing arrangement in Ghana comes with the following benefits except. Eliminates poor performing teacher, eliminates poor teachers, enhance discipline among teachers, make teaching a professional activity. Answer eliminates poor teachers. 127. The free SHS policy was introduced in. Answer September 2017. 128. The Chief Executive Officer of the National Council for Curriculum and Assessment, NACI CA, is called. Answer. Dr. Edward Kofi Apia. 129. The current law that governs the Ghana Education Service GES is. Answer Act 1049, Act 2020. 130. The current membership of the GES Council members is. Answer 12. 131. The call for a universal learning design and friendly environment for Ghana education system can be likened to. Answer. Inclusive education. 132. How many ranks do we have in the Ghana Education Service GES? Answer 12. 133. Expanding and improving comprehensive early childhood care and education, especially for the most vulnerable and disadvantaged children, this statement is attributed to. Answer the Darker Framework for Action. 134. The Dakar Framework for Action adopted how many goals? Answer. 6 goals. 135. Where is the International Court of Justice situated? Answer Hague. 136. How many directorates does Ghana's Ministry of Education have? Answer 9. 136. Sector ministers are designed by law to establish a ministerial advisory board to advise the ministry on various relevant issues. Which of the following is not required to be on the advisory board of Ghana's Ministry of Education? Chairman of the Ghana Education Service GES Council, Director General of Ghana Tertiary Education Commission, Director, General of Ghana Education Service GES. Representative of the Ghana National Education Campaign, Answer Director General of Ghana Education Service GES. 137. All the following are role expectation of teacher associations except. Control of the behavior, organize in-service training, participate in member activities, seek interest of management, Answer Seek Interest of Management. 138. The Ghana Education Service GES was established in the year. Answer 1974. 139. The Ghana Education Service GES has divisions and units. How many divisions slash units does GES have? Answer 6. 140. The Education Regulators Body Act 2020. Act 1023, established the National Schools Inspectorate Authority with the main responsibilities. Which one of the following is not among these responsibilities? Develop school curriculum, enforce school standards, evaluate schools, inspect schools, answer. Develop school curriculum. 141. Which one? 1. Of these ranks in GES requires that an individual must have served for at least conservative years and must be a licensed member of a Ghanaian teachers' union. Answer, Assistant Director 1, Senior Superintendent 1, Superintendent, Teacher, Answer. Senior Superintendent 1. 142, The newly created service which is an agency under the Ministry of Education is called. Answer. Technical Vocational Education and Training, 
TVET. 143. The main function of an educational system is to answer mold character. 144. The main goal of school education is to develop answer knowledge, relationship and skills. 145. According to the choice theory the teacher's attitude towards their students is motivated by answer belongingness, power, freedom and fun. 146. Mrs. O.C. was having a hard time getting Edem to work in cooperative learning groups, instead of isolating him, she put him at a table with other students and instructed him to do his work. Next, she asked him to share materials with students at the same table. Now he can work in cooperative groups without getting into trouble. What is the name for the strategy Mrs. O.C. employed? Answer controlling students' behavior. 147. Current theories of classroom management see the teacher as Answer Leader 148. Classroom management principles are applied differently in primary and secondary schools because Answer schools are structured differently at these levels. 149. Mr. Asidu has difficulty keeping students on task. Which of the following strategies would most likely increase academic learning time in his classroom? Allow ample time for transition from one activity to the next, hold students accountable for work done during class, interrupt class presentations when distracted by student misbehaviors, utilize a good sense of humor in class. Answer. Hold students accountable for work done during class. 150. A teacher wants to have a class discussion in which all 23 of her students can participate equally. Which of the following seating arrangements would best suit this objective? Cluster style, face-to-face -face style, offset style, seminar style, answer. Face-to-face -face style. 151. Which of the following strategies is recommended for increasing academic learning time? Do not dwell on a top once the point has been made, flip-flop from one topic to another, maximize transition time between activities, respond to distractions, answer. Maximize transition on time between activities. 152. Generally, classroom rules and producers should be reasonable and answer necessary. 153. The best strategy to develop active listening skills is to practice. Answer. Paraphrasing other people's comments. 154. Assuming your staff new tasks is a way of helping them to. Answer. Respond to duty. 155. When getting students to share and assume responsibly in the classroom, teachers should. Answer involve them in the planning and implementation of classroom initiatives. 156. The types of accountabilities required in education are internal, external and impersonal, internal, external and professional, internal personal and group, internal, professional and group, answer internal, external and professional. 157. Amongst the various school records, the most comprehensive information about the pupils is found in the Answer Cumulative Record Book 158 The value that divides AA data set into two equal parts is basically called Answer Median 159 What is the median of of 1, 6, 4, 5, 2, 7 and 3? Answer 4. 160. The Education Regulatory Bodies Act, 2020, Act 1023, is an act that Answer establishes the Commission for Technical Vocational Education and Training. 161. Which of the following is not a function of the National Teaching Council? Accredited institutions offering teacher education and development programs, also license and accreditation to pre-tertiary institutions in Ghana, also temporary certificate to unqualified persons who who desire to teach. Provide a framework for the development of teacher education curriculum. 
Answer, also license and accreditation to pre-tertiary institutions in Ghana. 162, the National Teaching Council Board may suspend the registration of a teacher. Answer. When the teacher has made a false declaration in an application for registration. 163. Which of the following is true about the focus of the National School Inspectorate Authority, NASLA? 1. The quality of teaching and learning provided in pre-tertiary education institutions. 2. The qualification of teachers teaching in pre-tertiary education institutions. 3. The facilities available in pre-tertiary education institutions. 4. The system of internal and external examinations in pre-tertiary education institutions, answer. 1, 2, 3. 164, which of the following statements best describes the primary activity undertaken by the Ghana Education Service? Develop national curriculum for the pre-tertiary level, formulate approved national policies and programs for the pre-tertiary level, implement approved national policies and programs for the pre-tertiary level, prepare approved salary structure for teachers at the pre-tertiary level, answer. Implement approved national policies and programs for the pre-tertiary level. 165. Teachers facilitate effective learning in the classroom when? Answer. Students help in establishing classroom guidelines. 166. Peer teaching as a classroom management strategy is adopted in situations where? Answer. Top performers in class can help engage and educate struggling students. 167. The Education Sector Medium Term Development Plan, EDMTDP, is how many operational rolling plan? Answer. For year. 168. The three, three, major types of school records are Financial records, academic records, and Answer. Administrative records. 169. How many types of administrative records do we have at school? Answer, 13. 170. State three administrative records. Answer. Log book, visitor's book, admission register, class attendance register. 171. State three academic records book. Answer. Curriculum, school-based assessment, record book, textbook, inventory, Timetable, Cumulative Record Book. 172. The effort to stimulate, coordinate and guide the continued growth of teachers, individual and collectively, in the provision of lifelong learning in school is called. Answer Supervision. The three types of supervision are clinical supervision, preventive supervision and. Answer. Creative Supervision. 173. The type of supervision where both the teacher and the inspector feel open-minded and encouraged to be more innovative in fine-tuning the methodology that best suits the prevailing situation is called. Answer. Creative Supervision. 174. What cards are cards for keeping records on stock of materials received and issued in the school? Answer. Tally. 175. A book where summaries of income and expenditure transactions are kept are called Cash Book. 176. A book where income and expenditure are under various headings are called Answer. Cash Analysis Book. 177. A visit to schools by officers from educational officers or national schools inspectorate authority with the main purpose of ensuring effective quality teaching and learning as well as compliance to the standard guidelines of pre-tertiary education. Answer School Inspection 178 There are four, four, major types of inspection. They are whole school inspection, school performance inspection, compliance inspection and Answer Investigative Inspection 179. The District Education Oversight Committee DOC was established by the Ghana Education Act 506 of 1995 and as amended by the The Pre-Tertiary Education Act. Answer Act 2020, Act 1049 
180. The District Education Oversight Committee DEOC has how many membership? Answer. 13. 181. The Education Regulatory Bodies Act, 2020, Act 1023, is an act that Answer. Establishes the Commission for Technical and Vocational Education and Training. 182. Which of the following is not a function of the National Teaching Council? Accredit institutions offering teacher education and development programs, also license and accreditation to pre-tertiary institutions in Ghana, also license and accreditation to pre-tertiary institutions in Ghana, also temporary certification to unqualified persons who desire to teach. Provide a framework for the development of teacher education curriculum, answer. Issue license and accreditation to pre-tertiary institutions in Ghana. 183. The National Teaching Council Board may suspend the registration of a teacher. Answer. When the teacher has made a false declaration in an application for registration. 184. Which of the following is true about the focus of the inspection panels of National School Inspectorate Authority NASIA? 1. The quality of teaching and learning provided in pre-tertiary education institutions. 2. The qualification of teachers teaching in pre-tertiary education institutions. 3. The facilities available in pre-tertiary education institutions. 4. The system of internal and external examinations in pre-tertiary education institutions. Answer. 1. 3. And 4. 185. Which of the following statements best describes the primary activity undertaken by the Ghana Education Service GES? Develop national curriculum for the pre-tertiary level formulate approved national policies and programs for the pre-tertiary level, implement approved national policies and programs for the pre-tertiary level, prepare approved salary structure for teachers at pre-tertiary level. Answer. Implement approved national policies and programs for the pre-tertiary level. 186. Teachers facilitates effective learning in the classroom when. Answer. Students help in establishing classroom guidelines. 187. Peer teaching is a classroom management strategy is adopted in situations where. Answer. Top performers in class can help engage and educate struggling students. Use the following scenarios to answer questions 188, 189, 190, 191 and 192. A many teacher observed that the mentor is utilizing a teaching strategy characterized by a sequence of learning activities that shift the responsibility from the teacher to students. The mentor provides appropriate instruction, assists students and then allows them to work in groups and eventually, as individuals, carry out the exercise. Though the teacher provided promptings occasionally, students basically worked on their own to solve problems. 188. The observed teaching strategy moves through sequential stages of Answer. Focused instruction, guided instruction, collaborative learning, independent learning. 189. What is the intended outcome of this teaching strategy? Answer. To promote independent studies on the part of students. 190. Which one of the following is not a benefit of the observed teaching strategy? Improved student academic performance, increased student motivation and confidence, increased student dependency on teachers, increased student chances to be creative, answer, increased student dependency on teachers. 191. What teaching strategy was adopted by teacher? Differentiated instruction, gradual release of responsibility, team teaching, cooperative learning, answer. Differentiated instruction. 192. The teaching strategy adopted by the teacher enables the students to learn, 1. Social skills by interacting with one another. 2. To be independent from the teacher. 3. To think for themselves. 4. Focus only on knowledge acquisition, answer. 1, 2, and 3 only. 193, 
Which one of the following is not a principle in managing classrooms? Preparing lesson notes, focusing on building relationships in the classroom, setting boundaries and expectations in the classroom, taking a strength-based approach in teaching. Answer. Preparing lesson notes. 194. Which one of the following is not an approach to teacher assertive strategy in managing the classroom? Students suggest rules and guidelines to be adopted, teacher expectations are explicitly stated, there are positive and negative consequences depending on student behavior, teachers implement clear structure, answer. There are positive and negative consequences depending on student behavior. 195. A teacher who adopts student self-discipline approach to manage classroom is of the belief that. Answer. Students can be trusted to evaluate and change their actions so their behaviors. 196. Which of the following statements about discipline and punishment is correct? Discipline is the responsibility of the district director and punishment is the responsibility of the school head. Discipline is the responsibility of the school head and punishment is the responsibility of district director. Discipline focuses on promoting positive behavior and punishment focuses on imposing controls. Discipline focuses imposing controls and punishment focuses on promoting positive behavior, answer. Discipline focuses on promoting positive behaviors and punishment focuses on imposing controls. 197. Teachers are advised that in matters of student discipline, students should. Answer. Have a fair and impartial hearing. 198. Data-driven decision-making refers to decisions based on, 1, the implicit knowledge available to the decision-maker. 2, empirical evidence. 3, reactive feelings. 4, professional judgment. Answer 2 and 4 only. 199. The apex disciplinary authority that has the power to endorse any recommendation to summarily dismiss a teaching or non-teaching personnel from Ghana Education Service, GES, is the Answer GES Council. 200. Consensus as a decision-making strategy refers to Answer. Reaching a decision everyone can accept. Thanks for watching part 2 of the likely to come questions and answers, do subscribe, share, comment and like as well, see you in part 3.